Things an architect should know. Dynamic symmetry. Dynamic symmetry is the use of axes, grids, and controlling lines to create proportions or symmetries. The sculpture, Lakawan and his sons, was an ancient Roman sculpture. The sculpture uses formal subdivision, sometimes called dynamic symmetry. These are controlling lines in painting, sculpture, and architecture. This design technique was rediscovered in the Renaissance and used extensively in architecture. Greek and Roman temples used formal subdivision extensively as a compositional tool. Michelangelo's design of San Giovanni del Florentini uses dynamic symmetry using axes versus regular geometric shapes. This implies movement and disrupts the stability of a circle or square. By the superimposition of two pairs of cross axes, dynamic movement is established. There is tension between equal and opposing forces.